electric field and electric field intensity at the end of this lecture i will teach you how to solve two types numericals of electric field intensity before starting the lecture click on the subscribe button and get access to our hundred of unique and simple lectures for free in the previous lecture we learned that there is electric field around any charge particle either positive or negative Secondly we learn that if we place a test charge inside the electric field the test charge experiences electrostatic force thirdly we learn that electric field is in outward direction on positive charges and electric field is in inward direction on negative charges thus remember these three important concepts now what is electric field intensity well consider a big positive charge q as we learn that there will be electric field around this charge q let i bring a positive test charge small q inside the electric field of this charge now this positive charge will exert force f on this test charge because it has entered in the electric field of charge q when charge q exert force on test charge it will move away thus remember that this positive test charge experienced force f in the electric field let consider that i bring another test charge q near this charge q this test charge will also experience the force f of this charge hence it will also move away so we learn that positive test charge experiences force f inside electric field let me repeat it positive test charge experiences force f inside electric field we call this force as electric field intensity therefore we define electric field intensity as the force f experienced by a unit positive charge q in the electric field is called electric field intensity let me repeat it the force f experienced by a unit positive charge q in the electric field is called electric field intensity electric field intensity is denoted by capital e electric field intensity is e is equal to f upon q where e is the electric field intensity f is the force and q is the positive test charge note down that the si unit of electric field intensity is newton per coulomb we know that force is a vector quantity so electric field intensity is also a vector quantity the direction of electric field intensity is the same as the direction of force for example the direction of force on this test charge is like this so it is also the direction of electric field intensity here the direction of force on this test charge is like this so it is also the direction of electric field intensity now as a bonus step let me teach you my favorite question what is the difference between electric field and electric field intensity well remember that electric field is the spherical region around any charged particle while electric field intensity is the force of electric field exerted on a test charge or unit charge or we can also say that electric field is the man and electric field intensity is its strength thus remember that electric field is the region and electric field intensity is its force now let me derive the equation or formula of electric field intensity well let consider a big positive charge q we know that there is electric field around this charge now i bring a positive test charge q inside the electric field of this charge 
Let this test charge is present at a distance r from the center of this charge q. We learned in the previous slide that this test charge experiences force f of the electric field. We know that electric field intensity is E is equal to F upon Q. Rearranging this equation, we write F is equal to E into Q. Let I call this equation number 1. Now according to Coulomb's law, there is electrostatic force F between this test charge and this big positive charge. And this force F is equal to K into the product of magnitude of the two charges upon the square of distance between them. Where K is the Coulomb's constant and its value is equal to 9 into 10 to the 9th Newton meter squared per Coulomb. Let I call this equation number 2. Now plug in equation number 2 and equation number 1. We get E into Q is equal to K into Q into Q upon R squared. This small Q and this small Q cancelled out on both sides. We get E is equal to K into Q upon R squared, where E is electric field intensity, K is Coulomb constant, and Q is this charge and R is the distance from the charge. So electric intensity E is equal to K into Q upon R squared. Now note it down this equation and this equation. I will show you how to crack any numerical of electric field intensity in any college exam easily. For example, consider that a positive test charge of 20 micro coulomb is placed in an electric field. The force on it is 0.4 Newton. Find the magnitude of electric field intensity on a test charge. Well, firstly let me draw a freehand diagram. Let consider a charge Q and its electric field. Let a test charge Q is equal to 20 micro coulomb is present in this electric field. Let this Q charge exert force F. Force F is equal to 0.4 Newton on this test charge. We know that electric field intensity E is equal to F upon Q. Here, the force F is equal to 0.4 Newton on charge Q is equal to 20 micro coulomb. So, putting values in this equation, E is equal to 0.4 Newton upon 20 micro coulomb. We get E is equal to 20,000 Newton per coulomb. So, the electric intensity of this charge Q on this test charge is 20,000 Newton per Coulomb. I call such type of numericals as type 1 numericals. Because we are given only the magnitude of a test charge and a force. So we instantly use E is equal to F upon Q to get the required result. Therefore remember the magnitude of a test charge and the magnitude of a force and type 1 form of numericals. Secondly, consider that how strong is the electric field at 10 cm from a 50 micro coulomb source charge. Well, let me draw a freehand diagram. Consider a positive charge Q and electric field around it. Let the size of this charge is 50 micro coulomb. Now we are asked to find the electric field intensity at a point R is equal to 10 cm away from the center of this charge. Let this point is X. We know that E is equal to K into Q upon R squared. Here K is the Coulomb's constant. And its value is equal to 9 and to 10 to the 9th Newton meter squared per coulomb. We know that Q is equal to 50 micro coulomb and R is equal to 10 centimeter 
आर आर इज इक्वल टू जीरो पॉइंट वन मीटर सो प्लग इन ऑल दीज वैल्यूज इन दिस इक्वेशन ई इज इक्वल टू नाइन एन टू टेन टू द नाइन्थ एन टू फिफ्टी माइक्रो कूलम अपॉन जीरो पॉइंट वन स्क्वेर आई गेट फोर पॉइंट फाइव एन टू टेन टू द सेवंथ न्यूटन पर कूलम सो द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड स्ट्रेंथ Our electric field intensity at ten centimeter from the center of this charge is four point five and to ten to the seventh newton per coulomb. I call such type of numericals as as type two numericals because no value of force or test charge is given. Rather, the magnitude or size of source charge is given, and we are asked to find electric field strength at a certain distance. So remember that in type two form numericals, magnitude of source charge and a point at a particular distance are given. This was all about electric field and electric field intensity